What's up YouTube? It's Nethew JK here with part two to my bungee cord tutorial. In this part of the tutorial we will be going over the portals and all that good stuff. I do apologize for the extreme delay in this video. Um, but I had move and a whole bunch of crazy stuff went on in my life. So here it is. Um I hope you guys enjoy. If you find this helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe for more tutorials and stuff. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down in the comments. Alright, so today we're going to be using bungee portals. Uh, I found this on Spigot's website for bungee cord and you want to download it. And I already have it installed onto my hub server, but you want to go ahead and put it onto the your server, the hub server that people are actually going to be able to go through. So I already got it downloaded and installed on my server. So Right now, we're going to go straight to my server. Okay, so here on my server, um, I'm going to type slash glist. Oh, oh dang. Alright, glist. So, as you can see, I got my server's name on here is Hub, Minigames, and Gun Z. And just in case you guys didn't see my first video, um, this is a totally different setup than I had before. So, right now, we're in the Hub server, and let's say we want to make a portal to my Gun Z server. So, I already picked out a little area for this, and we're going to build it right in here. And I do apologize for the lag. My computer, I'm not on my normal computer, so. So, as you can see, you can walk into the portal, and you go nowhere. So, now we are going to make this an actual portal. You want to make a uh, cuboid of uh, the portal layout. But before I go any further, I do want to say that this plugin is dependent on world edit, you know, slash slash one and all that stuff. So you want to right click one corner or left click, I mean, and then you want to right click the other corner, you know, right click, left click, oh, up there. All right. So now you want to do slash b portals select zero uh, this is so that we can remove the filter I didn't really look at this long enough to learn about the filter um, just spell select right okay so there we go I have selected the area it says I have selected 16 blocks and zero have been filtered so now what we want to do is we want to type slash b portals create and then the name of the server that we want it to go to. So let me fix my typo. And we're going to want it to go to the gun z server. So now we got that typed in, we're going to hit enter, and we have our portal set up. Let me see if I have some way I can fix my graphics real quick. Hate this computer. Um, not really going to worry too much about it. So we're just going to go ahead and walk into the portal now, and it's going to connect us to the Gun Z server in my network. So here we are. We're connected to Gun Z, and to get back to the hub there is a uh, slash hub plugin which you type slash hub and it would connect you to your hub or lobby or whatever you have I think it's configurable but I will uh, make that the third link in the description the first link will be to the bungee portals page you know this page I got right here all opened up and my second link is going to be to the teleport signs which uh, I might make a video on how to use those later. And then the third link is going to be to the Slash Hub plugin if I can find it. So that is about it. That is my little short video for my bungee cord portals. Uh, remember to like, comment, rate, subscribe. Any questions, please feel free to put it down in the comment sections below. If I don't get to you in the comments, private message me and I'll get back to you. This is Nethu JK, and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial.